yeah, let's go. The good life. Uh, I did. I did check it. It does run the video, uh, like the intro video after where we had gotten before. So I'm not gonna need this. I don't think I'm gonna need this. Oh, the gamepad works now too. Hell yeah! Shout outs. And now I don't have to worry about Star Trek Online being weird later. Oh, this is gonna be so good. So good. I do. I'm gonna have to adjust the volume for every game we play. When we go back to play One it, see, this is still pretty super loud. A poor orphan named Dick Whittington found himself a cat. Okay. The two became close, and the cat proved very useful, working awfully hard for him. Before long, Whittington came to treasure the cat as an irreplaceable ally. And sure enough, okay, that should be reasonable. The cat to a merchant ship. Yeah, sorry, it started off super loud. Yeah, the acquired a audio defaults are a lot louder than this now. This changed Whittington's life forever. Cool. But Whittington didn't simply use that fortune for his own benefit. He paid it back to the many people who had helped him over the years. What a guy. And a cat is still the default you find. That's what well, this history guy found. Coupled with his honest character. Historical character. Let him to blah, blah, blah. Anyway. a wonderful wife. Hooray. In time, he was even the Lord Mayor of London. Well, that's pretty handy. This is the story of Dick Whittington and his cat. One every good Brit knows well. Good Brits in the chat, please confirm or deny. However... Whatever happened to the cat once it had brought good old Whittington all his copper and joy, you ask? Well, nobody seems to know. Oh well, game over. <laughs> Not even Dick Whittington himself. Unless we were commissioned by Dick Whittington to find out. This is a very similar font to the one they were using in PSO2 for the chapters. At least from what I remember of it. All of however many hours ago. I'm fucking stoked. I can't believe I waited this long to upgrade. I'm a jackass. This will be loading a little faster too. It's nice. I'll have to fire up, like, Wreckfest and stuff to see if it cleans up any of their issues. Remind me to go into the, uh, community, uh, posts on this and, uh, thank the person who mentioned you could, uh, go upgrade. Play a bit of Chug on the cutscene. Well, this is it. Rainy Woods. The way you'd want to come here. They used to call it the happiest town in the world, but that was over 30 years ago. Now I hear it's just fallen to bits and full of weirdos. I I'm gonna just uh, have to adjust the overall audio output. You'd be better off. We've got it down to like three on the mixer. Grass me. Teach your own, I suppose. You stop hitting on me. Enjoy your holiday, then. What a goddamn hellhole. I love her already. This is Naomi Haywood, a photographer from New York. Now, why would someone like Naomi come to this far-flung corner of England? Because of all the interesting things to photograph, of course. That's it's chugging a little bit. I'm going to see if I can dial down the video settings. Again, my computer is still old, even with a new OS on it. ...has asked Naomi to investigate a secret. And she's hoping this job will help her escape a colossal mountain of debt. Fair enough. Who is this client? Well, that'll become clear soon enough. Whittington, he wants to know what Let's happened to the cat. Happens next it's gotta time. be, otherwise I don't know why you would have given me the spiel at the beginning. Well then, are you ready? Sure. Ah! Don't they have pest control around here? You got any idea how much these sunglasses cost? Goddamn hellhole. I'm from New York. There's probably pigeons everywhere. Welcome to Rainy Woods. 
This is the happiest town in the world. I love the texturing on everything. We're delighted to have you here. How do you do? Uh, it's a pleasure to meet you, I'm Miss Haywood. I'm Elizabeth Dickens. Um, my accents are going to be terrible. I, I, I will say that right now. I've been waiting for you ever since I received word that you'd be arriving in our town today. The master manipulator strike again. I beg your pardon? I wasn't talking to you, girl. Girl? Anyway, girl, do you know where I can find a place to stay around here? Somebody has got a clean tub, Wi-Fi, and room service? Don't you worry, Miss Haywood. I've got your house all sorted for you. My house? Right, no room service, I'm afraid, but it does have a lovely garden. You can use the internet there, too. I'm falling somewhere between, like, Gaelic and Australian. Terrible. Hey, if you think you can rip me off, you're barking up the wrong tree. Oh my. Rip you off? You're a funny one, Ms. Awood. That house is a gift to you from a town. Gift? Yes, a gift. First. <laughs> what are you scheming, huh? Tee hee scheming? Nothing at all, of course. But it doesn't make any sense. Why would you give a free house to someone you don't even know? Because communism! There's the Soviet National Hymn right here. Um... Rainy Woods, the happiest town in the world. We welcome anyone, who, everyone who comes to visit here. What's more, I heard you'll be staying with us for quite some time. In which case, it's only proper that you get your own house to rest in at night now, isn't it? But still. Oh, that's right. I've already had your belongings collected from town hall and delivered to the house. How about hidden there now so you can get yourself sorted? No, you will love it. No, you're pushier than I thought. He, <laughs> well, I am the one in charge of a town hall. Anyway, as I said before... I'm sorry, it was still her. Welcome to Rainy Woods. The happiest town in the world. Please accept my heartfelt welcome and make yourself at home. Alright. Destination icon. Okay. I love all the interface stuff all looks really good too. Alright, uh. I'm trying to find a uh, settings thing. Oh, can you get different cameras? Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Oh shit, video. Um. Eh, okay. I'm just gonna go with it. Yeah, it doesn't need to be chugging too bad now that we're actually in gameplay. It's more the cutscene stuff that doesn't. Okay, left trigger's a uh, camera clock. Alright, well, let's get photographing. Oh, happy scones. Left trigger to take the photo. Oh, maybe what certain ones do uh, color in black and white, respectively. Indicator here. Oh. All right. Grab some wild sage. Oh, let's uh, photograph some people. Metal Barrel too. I would have like a film limit or something. Dead and black coffee. Not, not even breakfast, just black coffee. I kind of want to get him in the shot there. Of course it focuses on the planter. I guess certain people are going to ask for certain photos and stuff. Does it really give me an entire house as a welcome present? I'm not dumb enough to believe this, but now I'm really curious. I guess I can't hurt to stop by and take a look at the place. Oh, this is... Yeah, 
Yeah, I'll try to play around with the settings of the full version before we start to see it, make sure to avoid this. It's all dirty. The garden's a mess. The place is even more of a dump than I expected it to be. Not even close to the town. I'm in the backwoods. We live in the backwoods. Like you never trust anyone who gives you something for free. But I guess on the bright side, it'll give you total privacy. Considering the reasons I came out to this godforsaken place, it might be the perfect hideout. Let me try setting it down to low. See that at least it out. Seriously? Oh, well, at least I have a computer. Come check the piece. All right, my choices are medium and high. So, cap it at 60. That might be part of the weird. It's only streaming at 62, so there's really no reason to go over and above. Look at this dump. That's actually a nice kitchen. Oh, let me get the cobweb in there. There we go. Like that. Just a little bit. Just a little bit of cobweb. Check the box. We found a potato. Potato seeds. Oh god, is there a farming mini game? I didn't follow much of the dev updates after I backed it, so. Alright. We don't have any bread. Although that would explain the lovely garden. Oh, we can make a jack of potato. Critically good potato. That's so cool! You need other places to learn how- This is- Okay, this is too much game for me. I'm sorry, this is- Alright, well we have Jack and Potato. Put it down. Put it down at the table, I guess? Hold A to eat. Okay. I'm stuffed. Can I feed other people then? Or like, just leave food out for people? Can't really use the stove. So, so damn slow. First things first, they need to check and see if my client sent me anything. Oh, Outlook, watch out, I get it. Alright, uh... Nice to see you, nice, from the Rainy Woods Info Hub. Do you know the Witch's Forest? Uh, to the west side of town? Some people say that honest to goodness witch lives the even side. Look, it's a, such a spine tingling rumor be true? Well, this is Rainy Woods, a town full of happiness where anything can happen. And if you're not spellbound by tales of witches and witchcraft, the forest is also a great place to try mushroom picking. <laughs> what? We promise it's more fun than the weird teacher you had in second dairy school made it sound. So throw on your anorak and give it a go. But pick responsibly, eating random mushrooms willy nilly could lead to a less than magical experience. I already love this game. I want a game where I, I want to shroom and shit in real life. I want to turn to a cat in real life too, but I mean, I'll take what I can get. I'm going to take them to a restaurant and ask the cook there to prepare them for you. Okay. And then we could probably learn from the chef how to do it ourselves. That's probably what the percentages were next to the different recipes. You know, like toast. Know how to toast. Alright, you are automatically subscribed to the Rainy Woods Info Hub upon moving to Rainy Woods. The moment you open this email, you are assumed to have agreed to our terms and conditions. That's kind of dirty. Um, unsubscribe for all future Rainy Woods uh, Info Hub newsletters and special promotions. Please click here. Once you see the message you have been unsubscribed, the process will be complete. But I can't actually move the cursor. Alright, uh... I'll go soon. Score in my spotlight. Treat yourself to the ultimate mushroom cuisine. Throw one back at the pit pub, top pub in Rainy Woods. The ultimate mushroom cuisine. If you've got a hankering for a shroomy dish, then head on over to Mushroom and Evans, where their meals are curated by the town's very own genius cook and mushroom maniac. And now we know where to uh, trade in our shrooms. You'll question their legality. <laughs> the mushrooms dance across your palate like the jewels of the forest they are. We're from the chef. Good grief. I'll have a mountain of mushroom pasta and... Piping hot pie is waiting for you, so pop in any time. 
Not pub in rainy woods. Here's a question for all you pub quiz masters out there. Name one English town that doesn't have a great British pub. Bet you can't. You're in the middle of nowhere. Rainy woods is no different. 1977 will set you right with fresh ale, ice cold lagers, uh, hearty stouts, and hearty stouts. So be sure to drop in and wet your whistle. We're from the bartender. Just shut up and drink, man. That's all for this issue. Have a good life. Automatically subscribe. Notification again. Dear Naomi Hayward, this is Lucy Turner from Morning Bell News. I'm sure you've already heard, of, heard about the new photo sharing service to take the... Flamingo is Twitter. Okay. Taking the world by storm. Flamingo. It has a new type of system where you can make money through advertisement fees paid out by sponsors based on the number of emokes you earn. Uh, I thought it might help you pay off a little of your debt, so I made an account for you. The app is already installed on the old PC I sent to your house, so after you read this mail, try start up the app and give it a try. That's what the different names are. People are going to ask for different photos and stuff. I'm rooting for you. Uh, I'd always be there to support you along the way. Special Correspondent Division 2. If you're reading this, you must have arrived safely to... Uh, you must have safely made it to Rainy Woods. I'm sure you must be exhausted after such a long trip. I think what I'm going to do is change voices for characters as we, like, encounter them and hear them, if we do. Like, I don't know if she's going to call us later or what. But, like, for the townsfolk, I'd like to hear them talk at least once before I, uh, assume what they sound. So, exactly what sort of place is the happiest town in the world? I'm sure it must be like stepping inside a fairy tale. I wish I could go and see it myself. But, of course, we didn't send you there just so you could enjoy a relaxing and deluxe vacation. We want to know why you... People call it the happiest town in the world. Your job is to bring that secret to light. As I'm sure you know, the current amount you owe our company is 30 million pounds. That's so much. I couldn't believe my ears the first time I heard about it. But don't worry, this is your chance to make the astro that astronomical debt disappear in the blink of an eye. During your stay in town, we here at Morning Bell News will send you a series of job requests. We'll pay you handsomely for each job, so be sure to use a portion of your profits to help pay off your debt. By the time you manage to complete all the jobs, I'm sure you'll have managed to pay everything off. And of course, even if you don't manage to do all the jobs, as long as you can unveil the town's secrets to us, we promise to pay out the full reward for all the requests combined. I'm rooting for you, and I'll always be here to support you along the way. I wonder if there's going to be an option to, like, not reveal the secret. Jeez. I hate apps like this, but if it'll help me make the money off my photos, that might as well check it out. Just upload a photo and check it out. So nocturnal animal life, monsters, painters, stylish hats, or luxury yarn. Dark. The black and white. Oh, there might be different lens and flash settings and stuff. That makes sense. Oh, but the upload time takes a while. Of course. The internet heal out here is prehistoric. That's why I hate the boonies. Sit here, sit and wait for this to finish uploading. I'll be here until the sun goes down. Head back down to the town center and start doing some legwork. Alright. How to do photo. I'll probably get us to the angle with the right stick. Oh, cool. We can hit the left one for tag info. Cool. So uh, we saw stylish hats. They reset Mondays and Thursdays. I'm guessing in game and not in real time. Oh, I like that they're on the deep pad there. On. Okay, yeah, nocturnal animal life, monsters, painters, stylish hats, and luxury yarn. Let's try to find some stylish hats. And for some beauty care? Absolutely. Oh, oh, it, oh it's like uh, shaving and showering was in Deadly Prem. Fashion plate. Uh, it looks like with the left and right, it looks like you can set specific outfits too. <sighs> the 
probably waste some time, but also, like, improves your mood. Okay, I see stomach meter, eye meter, heart meter. We could sleep. See this, she does not necessarily make the bed. And we got sparkles. Also, maybe certain people will only talk to you. This is all speculation. Again, I did not follow the uh, updates. But I feel like some people might only talk to you if you're... Uh, in certain shape, why not? This way, you can plant seeds in your garden. If you plant a seed in your garden and wait over a day, it'll start to grow. Once it's fully grown, you'll be able to harvest it as a material. Okay. Well, we have some seeds. We found some in that one box. We will have jack and potatoes forever. Oh, just, this is a little potato with eyes. That makes sense. Oh, potatoes are seeded. Alright, actually, I'm gonna... I'll try capping it at 30 to see if that helps, but I have doubts. Yeah, not really. It looks a little worse. Oh well. I also wanted to put thing up. Ask me to drop so I can tell. More details. I'm still getting used to intent. There we go. That's what I want to see. Process. We're doing pretty good, actually. Okay, cool. Anyway, moving on. Oh, we do have a run, and we have stamina to worry about when we do. Okay, but come on, right, what's over here? Gage? Mint seeds, okay. Oh god, but if you grow mint, that stuff's, like, a plague. That's gonna f just fill the garden up. Alright, so yeah, we're looking for stylish hats. Raiding this person's backyard. Oh, can you plant in other people's stuff, too? I mean, I should probably ask first. Oh, look at this little guy. Can't zoom in at all, that's fine. Oh, that, okay, that counts as nocturnal, what I thought. Oh, and I could just check the hot words on the go? That's good. Monsters, painters, stylish hats, and luxury yarn. Okay. I was just taking photos for style's sake. ATM to pull your money out. Pause it online. Everybody's in such a hurry. Oh, they just got oh, they're going to the shops and stuff too. This is... All right, so my objectives here: Here's the happiest town in the world. Uncover the secrets of rainy woods. Okay, I guess we should probably ask around. I guess. Oh, 1977 was the pub. Let's have a drink, as one do. 
Oh, I just noticed there's a mood meter just under her. So yeah, that's probably where the in part where the shower comes in. Oh my god. I love her. Boy, now you, you look like that ass who enjoys a good bevy. I'm Michelle O'Reilly, the bartender here in 1977. Be free to pop in whenever you get you fancy getting flooded, like. Hey. I need a drink. Boy, photographer, what'll it be? Roasted nuts. Cauliflower cheese. I, I, I just came into this hungry. Right up a little. Um. Right, rainy amber. Mentioned loggers. Luxury pale ale with two times the hose. I have a feeling that's supposed to be hops. <laughs> but who doesn't like two times the hose? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, it's a great type. All right, red ale. I, I like. I do like a red ale. Um, oh, options, options, options. Shandy Gav. An actual straight up Shand. Real. Beverages for babies. What's a Florida? Oh, it's a mocktail. Pessimistic philosopher. I'm a sassy tea. Not gonna lie, I I my life is sleepless ambition. Let's go. Let me know if you need anything. Like, can you also like learn how to uh, become a mixologist? Like learning how food tastes too. Hey. All right, let's chat. Hey. You see, you're looking your langus as always. Got a heap of great drinks in my, my collection, so like, feel free to pop in every day if you want. Apps and oh, fucking lovers. Oh, I guess certain backers were able to submit like images to, or or is there is actually is there actually like a let's player who also turns into a dog, um, which would also be super cute. But actually, that makes that would make more sense. to reintroduce myself to Miss Hayward. My name is Elizabeth Dickens. I work in residential affairs division at Town Hall. I have an older brother named William. He's a rather funny fellow, T. But it's, it's, it's for now. I hope, do hope you take a look at, take a look to me and Rainy Wood. Now we got fashion. Side. Oof. This is just like the this is my hole, it was made for me, me video game form because it's just you get to wander around and look at stuff, and oh my god. God, this is really the happiest town on earth. You have to get used to the slow walk cycle, but. Concoctions? Are we doing like potions? No. There was the implication of magic. Let's go meet this. Kid. How are you? Um, who are you? Hey. Uh, I'm Naomi Haywood, a photographer for me. A photographer? Am I? I'm, I don't. I'm, 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 I might just nix the accents altogether because they're just gonna bleed together. I'm Emma McCauley. My grandpa's the vicar. Congratulations. Oh, fast camera repairs. Maybe you sell new cameras. Or new lenses. Get a fisheye lens. Make a rap video. <laughs> hey, would you have a moment? Seriously? 
Whoa, where'd you? Whoa, where'd you come from? Be a full, full moon tonight. So I must ask you to refrain from going outside. Huh? It's a bit too early for you. Once the moon begins to rise, I must ask you to return home quickly and stay indoors. And why exactly do I have to do that? I've asked you nicely is why. You must go outside at night for your own good. You know we're going to go out tonight. Nobody's here. Maybe we'll meet the camera guy eventually. Or maybe they don't have the new cameras in the demo, so. Oh, stylish hats. There's probably one in the store, if nothing else. The, the, the clothing store. I already lost track of. I'm sorry. There we go. Fancy and bunny. Oh, actually, are there any in the window? Because we could try that, too. No. Ah, oh, maybe. There's one of that. There's one hat right there. I'm gonna... Count it as hat flavored. Stylish hats! Let's get some of the bunting in there. You. I'm Virginia Yates. I run Funny and Bunny, a little shop that sells knickknacks. Actually, a tailor, though. If you bring the materials, I can together whatever you like. Don't forget, Virginia Yates is this town's number one tailor. Especially busy from midnight to early morning, so you better not come knocking at during that time. Oh. What are you waiting for? You need something, though? Here to shop. Okay, you can buy a material Deadpool. <laughs> He would. He would. Drink King. Drink King is the hashtag that um, it's where he puts on all of his uh, beer Instagrams when he's out drinking. That's great. Weird seat. Take one of those. Boreak. Different weird seed. So many weird seeds. Or, or maybe you don't, maybe they list as weird seeds until that you've grown them at least once and you uh, find out what they produce. That's probably a, kind of like how you learn new stuff about the food. We'll start with seeds first. I don't have room for all this stuff in my pockets anymore. Anyway. Stuff goes out of stock for a while. Okay. Uh, evening's not that far off, honestly. We're already at 55. Might force me to go back home. Yeah, if it's 7 p.m. I forgot where my house is. Oh, duh. Map. Back of construction. I, okay, I'm, I'm loving the, the lion with the hammer. That's a great logo. Oh. Basically a full stamina bar to get out of here. This, this is my place, right? Yeah, okay. Forage. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Large things go there. Got it.
Not even for Saturday. Okay. I don't know which maybe I'd gotten the Switch version. Oh. I don't, I would don't like stay on top of watering or everything. I'm not, uh, also kind of curious, like how many days the demo even covers. to go outside and that just makes me want to do it even more. Whatever, time to check out the town. Well, the I thing might not be appearance, it might be like how awake you are. I just since there's the caffeine option. Alright, so back into town. Okay, so the more town that's on camera, the more it chugs, which makes the game seems to just load everything all at once. Kingdom for more. Oh, double tap to. Yeah, hopefully we'll find a better way to optimize this. Like, again, I'm watching my performance and everything, and it seems fine. I don't know what the deal is. Computer performance. Uh, my video card's old, but it's not that, it's not that old. I did it too. Maybe there's some stuff I could prioritize or whatnot. Oh, man. Work here. Beetles? Uh. Oh, cool. Once you found something once, it doesn't kill again. Bartender or a dog is whatever. No way. Is is this the town's big secret? Spoiler alert, it is the town's big secret. Right. This town's been hiding a rather beastly secret. Now this is one hell of a scoop. I told you not to come here. Uh, Elizabeth? The story so much come across urgent quest. Make sure you don't get yourself distracted if you want to complete these before you run out of time. Okay. 
Uh, rainy cats and dogs, where do you want me to go? So, uh, oh, okay, just follow her, got it. Oh, black dog. At least they have a veterinary clinic. It's a lot cheaper than having to go to a hospital. Maybe. Two more life slots left to fill up either. Well, I haven't eaten in a while. Chloe's at the church. Look, there's something up on the church's bell tower. Maybe it's related to what's happening? I should check it out and send a report back to Morning Bell if I find anything. How the hell am I going to get up there? I have a feeling she knew I was going to pull this nonsense. Right, all right, I'll follow you. I also appreciate that the quests do give you like a tour of like go. Really living up to the name Rainy Woods. You the witch in question? Oh, now I can plant my own sage. Hooray. We got some sage with the seed. He's what's a rush? Where'd she go? Urgh. Goddamn hellhole. I like the icon they use for hold the button down. It's the little curves under the uh, <laughs> letter there. Do you realize what you just stepped into, sweetheart? Apothecary, I thought. People around here call this place the witch's house. The, the witch's house? <laughs> Bum, da, da, da. Ah! I love her already. She's just some old hippie. I'm Pauline Atwood, but everyone calls me the Woodland Witch. Ha. Huh? What's that? So what can I do for you? I smell like booze. <laughs> Tell me where it's against the rules to get absolutely bladded in the company own home. <laughs> well, I guess you're right. Huh? Who might you might might who might you be got? Got you barged into my home at this time of night for? Oh right. Hey Granny, you see a girl named Elizabeth around here? She's a quiet type with red hair. Rides around this crazy high deck wheelchair. Sure. Why exactly are you looking for a girl named Elizabeth? Again, all the voices are kind of bleeding together. I will try to distinguish better next week. I thought she was going to take me somewhere, but then I suddenly lost track of her. All the other townspeople turned into... Ah! That's right, something weird is happening in Rainy Woods right now. What's going on? Do they have some sort of device set up that makes people hallucinate? Or is it the result of some human experiment? Couldn't possibly be, couldn't possibly be real magic, right? What on earth are you talking about, sweetheart? Well, um, er, anyway, I just need to find a way to get to the top of the church's bell tower. I'll be able to solve this mystery as long as I can get up to what... Get to what's up there. 
That's what my intuition as a pro photographer is telling me. I don't follow, but it looks to me like you've got a case of the collar you all, please. Oh, well, see, I have this big dead end. <laughs> I've just got just the thing for you. If you wish to solve your problems, go and gather these things for me. Gather them all before time runs out, I'll make a very special concoction for you. Special concoction? A concoction that'll make you feel like you can fly right up to the heavens. It'll get me really high. What I mean is I'm sure it'll, it'll take you right to where you need to go. Alright. Nice. So simple-minded. Go and get. Three helpings of catnip and one tear fruit. Okay. Picture the mural from the area. The idea that we're gonna get other recipes from other photos too, that's cool. Seriously? Oh well, cool, it's like an RPG. Time limit. Until 8 a.m. Okay. Mm. Yeah. So tear fruit. <laughs> Bill's here. And no dos, alright. Three cat and one tear fruit and a mural. The, the, the mural at least should be on the map uh, location wise. How about the rest? Okay, I see, I see waypoints for pretty much everything here. Let, let's get this one this yeah this path that's like it looks like it's behind here that's not the way we came in I'd rather grab that first oh yeah it's, it's much closer too that's probably the tear fruit or tear fruit Take some more. Stop tiring myself out. You got a chug so bad. You know, I will. That's probably the mural with the recipe. It looks like the. I'm gonna see if I can vault the uh, fence, but it looks like it's cut. Bro, it's fine. Yeah, that's definitely a recipe. Oh. Add nip. Okay. Or at least the, the clock seems to slow down to match. Not like... Even with the chug, I'm not like screwing myself over with the timer. That's not... Just 
bums me out a little that we're not getting the effect or whatever. I like this chill soundtrack. I really tried looking up at the skybox at all. Catnip, okay. Ace. Okay, there are, okay, there are gaps. Go oh, here. Out back there. See the moon? Oh, yeah. Wait. Just walk past it. Three AM or eight AM the mark on that. It hasn't cut me off yet, so hopefully we can just get it. I feel like getting to the bell tower is going to be the cutoff, the demo. But oh god, are we going to get so buried in systems? I will try to uh, maybe set it up so I do farming and stuff on my own time. <laughs> Got the goods. What's that? Be able to get everything I asked for, sweetheart. Oh. Be help as a cat and one tear fruit. And you've managed to snap me a shot of that mural. You're more skilled than I took you for, sweetheart. Uh -huh, if you say so. Now I can finally prepare the secret concoction. One sip and all your worries will be whisked away. That it was worth gathering up all that crap. It was worth it, alright. I just realized she's got a cigar in her teeth, too. Here's something to get the concoction. I'm thinking this cushy you roll mine, I'll roll yours. The old going on here. But yeah, that's, pro that's probably not a cigar, it's probably a blunt. <laughs> but we're concocting then. Alcohol Alcohol brings happiness to all. All who drink become happy. Again, other things he swear he himself has posted on his Instagram account when out drinking. Ignoramus et ignor... In this? That one I don't recognize. Wadman potion, okay. A lot more agile morale, you say. What the? Everyone's back to normal. Uh, everyone's back to normal. Okay. Unless you're Hi, good morning. Lovely day, isn't it? Elizabeth. That's right. I thought she was going to go the, across the neck like I saw you out last night. You're going to get it. The witch's concoction is supposed to make me higher than a kite. Time to give this thing a try. Got that wizard weed. It, maybe it's a separate concoction that gives you the dog powers.
Oh, she's cute. Here's how much of your fashion carries over is just the glasses. Prove that you require the sensibility of a cat. Allows you to transform into a cat whenever you want. Okay, so right pad. Still hungry. Okay, and I can't change out of it. Or no, left to react to you. That's kind of cool. Do it on the fly. Should have grabbed something to eat. Well. And if maybe she lowered the glasses while she was. Things seem to run a little better while we're at Animal 2. Your animal vision is easy to climb up areas that would otherwise be inaccessible. Glowing claw marks, simply hold left trigger. Left trigger for vision, right trigger for jumpies. Okay. I have a feeling these are the our Kickstarter backer, backers of a certain level, the ones that have names on them. I could be wrong. Wait, what? Okay. I don't remember what the backer rewards exactly were. But hey, there we go. Kind of sad, it just, uh, oh. Got a default for you. But at the same time, it makes my life easier. Oh, and now, now things are chugging because I can see a lot more of the map from up here. Alright. As if I could actually, you know, yell that. I don't know why it's uh, not letting me get up there. It's weird. Unless there's another path here. That I so I can't actually get up to the height that I need to, or I try transforming it to hit the top here. Listen. <laughs> I seem to have jumped a little higher than the last time either. But, nope. Check in the Steam community thing to see if maybe somebody else has had this. <clears throat> There's a lot more after this. Oh, 
Okay, other people have had trouble getting up to the top of the tower. I mean, I'll try a couple more times to see, and if it doesn't work, I'm just gonna call it there. But I like, I, I'm pretty much. I mean, I can't really be unsold since I helped back it. But hell, all right. Yeah, I can't progress if I don't do that anyway. So the demo clearly has some issues, but. Hopefully, that uh, people have gotten past it. Otherwise, I don't know if it's the this version that's gotten kind of screwy. But like, if they updated something for the Steam Fest one and something bugged out. But again, we'll be playing the full version next week, and hopefully that'll be fixed. Pulls anything else. But if you want to check out this demo? It is on Steam still. It wasn't Next Fest only. So there you go. Looks good. So we're, I, I wish there were more like granular video settings to hopefully fix that frame rate issue as well, but we'll see what they tweak in the coming week, if anything. Anyway, I'm going to call it. Yeah, you got about an hour of that, so.